Hi friends, welcome to MX. On this video, we are going to see about the power plant engineering basic concepts. That's the fuel and combustion. First, coming to types of coal, it's anthracite. Anthracite contains more than 86% of fixed carbon and less volatile matter. Volatile matter helps in the ignition of coal, so it is often difficult to burn the anthracite. Bituminous, it contains 46.88% of fixed carbon and 20.40% of volatile matter. Lower the volatility, higher the heating rate. Lignite is the lowest grade of coal containing moisture as high as 30% and high volatile matter. Peat contains up to 90% of moisture and it is not attractive. Now you can see in this graph the moisture, volatile matter and fixed carbon. The percentage 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. The lignite, sublutimous, sublutimous, the high volatile, medium, low volatile, semi anthracitical anthritical and meta -anthritical. Coal analysis, proximate analysis. The proximate analysis indicates the behavior of coal when it is being heated. Moisture content of coal. When 1 gram sample of coal is subjected to a temperature of about 105 degrees Celsius for a period of 1 hour, the loss in weight of the sample gives the moisture content of the coal. That is for 1 gram sample of coal, we will be eating 105 degrees Celsius for 1 hour. The loss in weight of the sample gives the moisture content present in it. Volatile matter. When 1 gram of coal is placed in a covered platinum crucible and heated to 950 degrees Celsius and maintained at the temperature for about 7 minutes, there is a loss in weight due to the elimination of moisture and volatile matter. The volatile matter consists of hydrogen and certain hydrogen carbon compounds which can be removed from the coal simply by heating it. This is known as the volatile matter present in the coal. And coming to ash content, by subjecting 1 gram of sample of coal in an uncovered crucible to a temperature of about 720 degrees Celsius until the coal is completely burned, a constant waste is reached, in which it indicates that there is only ash remaining in the crucible. And this is known as the ash content in coal. Fixed carbon. Fixed carbon is the difference between 100% and the sum of the percentage of moisture ash and volatile matter. Thus the proximity analysis of the coal is given by Fc plus Vm plus M plus A equal to 100% by mass, where Fc is fixed carbon, V is volatile matter, M is moisture and A is termed to be ash. Things to be known are, more volatile a coal, more it will be smoke, but volatility helps in ignition. Lower rank coals are characterized by a greater oxygen content that aids ignition and enhances compressibility and also flame stability. Coming to ultimate analysis, the ultimate analysis gives the chemical elements that compresses the coal substance together with ash and moisture. The formula C plus H plus O plus N plus S plus M plus A equal to 100% by mass, where M is moisture, S is sulfur, N nitrogen, oxygen, nitrogen, ash, and C is termed to be carbon. The things to be known are the coal that does not take cake is called pre burning coal. A free burning coal has a high value of swelling index, which indicates that the somewhat expands in volume during the combustion. This is the things to be known. Hope so friends you understand what is the power plant engineering and the types of coal the present in the fuel and combustion. This will help you in understanding and solving the problems. Thank you.